aloe vera. Look, aloe vera. Look at that beautiful aloe vera. See the gel there that we can get straight out. Look at that beautiful gel. If we've got cuts or burns or whatever. Aloe vera, that's a desert plant. People will tell you it certainly won't grow in an aquaponic system. Have a look where it's growing. It's growing in a grow bed that is now actually at the top of its flood. It'll drain again shortly. But look at that beautiful, fresh aloe vera. Look at that gel. Isn't it fantastic? Perfect, fresh aloe vera. That alone is good enough reason, in my book, to have an aquaponic system. This bush has already flowered. It's quite a mature bush. You can see we've got others here. We've got heaps of aloe vera. Isn't it wonderful? You've seen the aloe vera. Now look at the garlic chives. Look at these, garlic chives. Growing in, look at that. I take that up to my wife in the kitchen and say, sweetheart, you're doing a stew tonight. Here's some garlic chives. Have a look, beautiful, fresh garlic chives. Look at that. How fresh is that? Isn't that beautiful? Okay, look here, parsley, if you want parsley. As much parsley as you can probably imagine. Italian parsley. And here we've got, oh, look at this tomato bush. They grow like weeds, we'll get rid of that one. Um, all sorts of other things, more parsley, more um, peppermint and spearmint growing. Isn't it fantastic? Look at this one here. Here we've got lemon balm, and we've got ordinary, very aromatic, crush it up, very, very aromatic. Oh, great for colds and flu. Grows absolutely fantastically well in aquaponics. You can see we've got a mile of it here, an absolute mile of it. Thank you.